Well, welcome to the ALA virtual booth from Publisher Spotlight. I'm so sad I can't be with you to walk around our booth with you, but we'll do this instead and this will be fun. So welcome to our beautiful offices in lovely Smyrna, just outside Nashville, Tennessee. And right now we're gonna talk about our wow books. These are the books that when you see them in real life, you just go, wow. So let's start first with the Mountains of Mumbai from Cotta Details. This is by Labanya Gosh and Pallavi Eugene. And this is about a little girl from Ladakh and her friend who lives in Mumbai, she goes to visit her and the little girl really misses her mountains. And her friend says, you know what? We have mountains in Mumbai too. And we have, we have rivers in Mumbai. Aren't they spectacular? And we have towers. Really, we do. Let me show you. Yes, we have towers in Mumbai. So this is a story that is really a celebration of a place. And that place being the city and the wonderful diverse city that Mumbai is. So this is the Mountains of Mumbai from Kadadi Tales, a publisher based in Chennai, India. Next up from Tiny Al, we have The Secret of the Tattered Shoes. This is part of the One Voice, Many Stories. Sorry, other way, Many, Many Voices, One Story um, series from Tiny Al by Jackie Morris and Esan Abdullahi. And this is the story of the 12 Dancing Princesses. You probably know that, but I really, the story is beautifully written, but the illustrations are just to die for. I mean, look at that. It almost looks like those candles are actually on fire. They're not, which is a good thing. And this is just the story of this, this soldier who manages to figure out the secret of the tattered shoes and survive to wed the woman of his choice, who is not one of those 12 dancing princesses. Oh, I should have said spoiler alert, but you know that story. Also, another wow book is Magnificent Homespun Brown from Tilbury House. Tilbury House is based in Maine, and this is such a wonderful book. It says a celebration, and it is. It's a celebration of girls of color, and it is poetry. It is illustrations that just make you happy. Deep secret brown, like the subtly churning river currents, playfully beckoning me through my grandmother's kitchen window. Isn't that gorgeous? Feathery brown, like my lashes. So this is Magnificent Homespun Brown. Got lots of star reviews. Check it out, and it's got good book joy. You know what I mean? Next up from Gecko Press, we have Migrants. This is by Peruvian author illustrator Isa Watanabe, and this is a wordless picture book about the immigration experience. So it is absolutely lush and beautiful, but also heart wrenching and mysterious. So I hope you can see some of these gorgeous illustrations. And this is a book that would also be a really good writing prompt. So that is Migrants from Gecko Press. And lastly, from Raycraft, I'd love to show you Woodpecker Girl. This is based on a true story about a girl who, had cerebral, who has cerebral palsy. And the only way she could actually communicate was with this paintbrush affixed to her forehead, which is kind of like a woodpecker. The art in the book mimics her own art. And in the end, a really wonderful surprise is you actually have some of her original art. So you can see how the artist of the book really tried, drew inspiration from the artist that is pictured in the book that the story is about. So that is Woodpecker Girl, and this is from China, and it's published by Raycraft. So thank you so much for letting me show you some of my wow books, and I hope you'll check out some of our other videos as we keep walking around the booth.